Hey guys, welcome back to another episode on the Greenhouse SMP. Today we're going to do a couple of things, and one of them is something that I saw on the Empire's SMP, specifically LD Shadow Lady's video, and that has to do with chickens. So I've started actually taking it down already. So we have our cows in here and you know you push the button they float up on the water you feed them they kill each other from um, entity cramming we have the pigs and right here we had chickens but here's the problem these these right here these are the problem and let me show you why these are a problem because if you're not making a ton of cakes and you're not making a ton of other things that need eggs I don't actually know what else needs eggs. Pumpkin pies, maybe? Either way, if you're not making these sweets, you don't need eggs. And and we have a lot. This is, this is just one double chest. We've had so many that we have just gotten rid of. And I get tired of throwing them back into that single hole thing for entity cramming. So... What I saw on Lizzie's video was that she used a fox to be her chicken killer. And so it sets up kind of in the same way that a traditional chicken cooker does. And that is where you have the chickens on top of this hopper, goes into a dispenser, and the dispenser, when it recognizes that there is a an egg in there it goes through a redstone circuit and then spits it out and then there's a chance that you create a chicken in another area well in that other area instead of lava which you would normally see in a cooker we are going to have a fox and we have plenty they keep spawning over here we have one in here I think there's only one in here on a lead because they're, they're problematic. But because I have spruce forest all around me, they keep spawning in this area. So I might as well put them to work. Uh, so, yeah, we are going to um, use a fox as a chicken cooker. And I'm going to put my hat back on so that I can pick that up. Okay. So yeah, Fox is a, a chicken killer, not cooker, killer, and when it has something in its mouth, it'll drop the other, when it kills and puts something new in its mouth, it drops the other one. And either way, my hope is to get chicken, maybe feathers, but no eggs. So we'll see how this goes. Um, guys? Nursing? DSA? Are you guys here? Yep, I'm just breeding up more turtles. I got two helmets so far, but... Um, I'm coming back. Come, come to Central. Okay. Okay. We've, we've got, we've got tinkling sounds. <gasps> oh! I was going to get some honeycomb, but we can wait. Okay. Also, DSA, you nothing. haven't seen yet. Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> I have so sneaky pants. You have sneaky pants? Uh-huh. I'm confused, but okay. Do, do you not see me running? But While sneaking? sneaking? Wait! How did that happen? I raided an ancient city. Well, I started to. I got through one row. <laughs> I'll go back with you later. Okay. I, I definitely want to kill a warden at some point. A warden head. I did okay, get a head. Okay, but you said you heard... Yeah, 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 yeah. You said yeah, you yeah, heard yeah. tinkling. I did, I did, I did. And there's a message. Greetings. Greetings. Thank you oh. so much for rescuing our friends from the Illagers. They have requested you be rewarded for your bravery, and so we have left you each a gift in the barrel, the keepers. Oh, do you say you weren't with us, but we we did go do a woodland mansion, and and uh, Dr. Liz went and to a pillager outpost, too, and freed some LAs. Yeah, and they're so cute. Yeah. They are adorable. 
They really are. But apparently, apparently oh. the keepers are happy about this. What? <gasps> oh! oh. oh. Those they're are so, pretty. so pretty. And they get they, look, there's they're one named. for each of us. <gasps> oh, in our colors too. Do I look pretty? Oh my god. You gosh. look pretty. Do Wait, I look pretty? Like, oh, you look yes. gorgeous. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, and look at Dr. Liz. Oh my gosh. Oh, I they're love so it. pretty. Okay, I'm gonna fly with them, okay? Tell me how they look. Ready to go. Oh, if I can fly. Nope. There we go. Yay! Ooh. I mean, you got out of sight pretty quickly. Behind a tree. The tree. <laughs> so they, they don't have magical stop you from flying into trees no. powers. Oh. <laughs> no, or, or maybe my um, clumsiness just overpowers it. Oh, thank you. That, thank, thank you. you. That is, um, These yeah. are so cool. Of course it is. Oh, I can't sleep because it's not thunderstorm. Oh, did I show y'all guys? I finished the decorating in the tower. Oh, you did? Yeah. Well, except the second floor, because that one's just a bit hard to decorate. But the main like tower part, I got all of them decorated. Okay. Excellent. Yeah. Wait, one more flight. Yep, yeah, one more. <gasps> I, I like used it. the new wood, and I wanted to I, like all the beds Ooh. just in case. Yeah. This is so pretty. Yeah. Sorry. I also replaced the um fence so we could actually put a desk in and so just be careful yes. you may get stuck on the stairs a bit. Um but now all the tower rooms are filled finally. Nice. <laughs> I hear the little allays. They must be flying around somewhere. So yeah. glad that they're happy being here. Yes. Yeah, Ooh. me too. But, you know. We need to find some place to put them so that they're safe. Because I do think they don't seem to have the greatest survival instinct. Yeah, we haven't had any patrols come through. That's good. Hello, cutie pie. What happens if the patrols do come, true, I, come I, through? I don't know. I don't know if they take them captive again, or, or if they... I don't know what happens. Hello! Yes, you have bread. Come back downstairs. Oh, there's... I was like, where's my amethyst crystal one? There he is. Are you stuck back there? You, you look stuck. They, they do also like to fly into corners and just sort of get stuck there, and I'm not entirely sure how that works. Yeah. There we go. Come on. Back down. Are you stuck now? <laughs> You're so cute, little amethyst cluster. We should probably person. make them a home sooner rather than later so they don't, because these windows aren't very safe. Yeah. Okay, I can do that. Me too. I made one over by my house, too, so. Oh, nice. There's, there's one I've got two sleeping... more over there. There's one hanging out in the tree farm because that one has been helping me with tree farming because they like to play fetch. They do. <laughs> it is adorable. Look. So let me grab some bread. We don't have any bread. Uh, Here. Some amethyst. <laughs> yeah, throw some amethyst and, and watch. Yeah, <laughs> Did you so hear that sound? You. That is so cute. They and so yeah, they love to they're, they're like little puppies. They love to play fetch. Um, I don't have any bread, but I do have another rack I can switch you out. Oh, you already have there you are. C come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. He gives you the bread. He's so cute. He really wants the bread. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, I threw a stack at him. <laughs> that sound was so cute. He's so adorable. Okay. 
So it's all set. Um, this is, and I should probably turn my, my mob sounds down because this is ridiculously loud over here. Okay, that should work. Then we can still hear that they're making noise, but not as loud as they normally do. So, again, this is based on a, a chicken farm that I saw on LD Shadow Lady's video. I don't know if it was her design or if someone else uh, designed it and she was just using it. But I'm going to slip into spectator so that I can show you guys what's going on. Uh, this part back here is essentially a normal chicken cooker and I might have too many chickens in here. I didn't actually count when I was throwing eggs in so I just wanted to have a lot of chickens in here. So chickens lay the egg, it goes into the hopper that's below and then the hopper goes into a dispenser. The comparator reads this reads the signal from the dispenser meaning that there's something in it, uh, sends it to a repeater, which strengthens the signal, and we get the loop. So as long as there is something in there, because occasionally you do get two eggs at once, and the original way that I had this set up was that it would only do a quick um, observer. Uh, words are not coming to me today, but just a like a one tick flash type signal. And then the other egg would just sit there and then the comparator would never go off and then things would start building up in the dispenser. So I put the uh, clock on here to make the, the comparator flash. And so the observer sees that on the repeater and here I have it back here. And then there is actually. Oh, there's another observer that is looking at this one and that sends the redstone signal to the grass block that is in on top of the dispenser and the dispenser shoots it out and then we have a slab and we have baby chickens so the hitbox for baby chickens I did not know this it is just their body so their big giant heads have nothing to do with their hitbox <laughs> so the fox does not see them when they are baby chickens and then there's a moss carpet on top of there so that the fox does not see them and when they grow up their hitbox goes just above the uh, moss carpet and the fox can see them can eat them and their drops go into the hoppers occasionally they drop over here onto this grass block that the fox's tail is over right now and because of that I have the hopper minecart there going into the hopper chain into the barrel. Occasionally they're not growing up fast enough and the fox is eating them entirely. So what I have done to try to help with that a little bit is I put a berry bush in there so that the fox would have other food in its mouth um, just in case. <laughs> so, um, we do have some chicken and some feathers in here and some berries. I honestly don't know if this is from the chickens growing up in, uh, the, the egg collection area, because frankly, that does look like there's a lot in there. It's very possible that some of them died to entity cramming. And then the dispenser would shoot those out and those would have ended up in the hoppers. So it's very possible that this is not coming from the fox. We'll have to see now that they're all grown up and uh, we just we just need to wait for these chickens right here to grow up and see what happens. And again, most of this is is based on a like and not even two seconds clip on LD Shadow Lady's video, so I kind of guesstimated, but the concept was was from hers. So we'll see if this works. Obviously, he's he eats the berries. Um, I just don't know if he drops it to take chicken. But if they grow up at roughly the same time, then the extras should 
come into here. So we're going to give it a little bit of time and, and see what happens. All right, so after AFKing for about an hour, it does seem to be working. Uh, it's not very fast. We've got nine chickens in an hour, which I guess makes sense because you have the, the eggs that have to actually hatch a chicken. And then you have to wait, what, 20 minutes or so to let them grow up. And so it's working. It's slow. We don't need the chicken for anything except trading. So it, it's it's a very passive farm, which is fine. The fox gets food. We get chicken to trade. No big thing. Um, I can't even trade chicken with our butcher here. We have to go over to nursing's uh, butchers to get more because our butcher only takes pork. So... All in all, it works. I'm happy about it working. It has been quite the... What? Who are you? And what are you doing in here? <sighs> we, we keep getting foxes in our base and... I'm, I'm running out of places to put them. I put one to work. We still have the one up there who's just randomly picking berries all the time. Let's close that before anyone gets out. Ah. <sighs> And you killed a chicken. I don't know where you killed a chicken from, but... I mean... We have more animals in general that keep spawning in here. So... Yeah, I don't I don't know where to... We'll just bring him over here. Come on, you'll come live at my base. So yeah, it's it's been eventful today. Uh, you know, we had, we had the... I made the, the fox chicken farm, and we got some shiny new wings. It has been a great day, and I hope you guys have had a great day. Thank you so much for watching and joining me, and I will see you next time.